So I am uh, here at Children's National Medical Center, and I do research on uh, brain development. We primarily look at a mouse as a model of human brain development, and uh, surprisingly, the mouse fulfills this role quite well. The processes of forming the brain in the fetus, uh, putting together different circuits that regulate different parts of the regulate different behaviors, are quite conserved through evolution. And uh, what we do is we try and understand the genetic and cellular basis of how the uh, social brain is set up. So uh, what's going to come up on this uh, slide is, is actually a, a diagram of the human limbic system. And uh, as you know, the brain has a number of different structures within it that regulate different behaviors. There are structures for language, there are structures for vision, uh, as well as a whole host of other structures. And this, this beautiful rendering uh, drawn by my very talented postdoctoral fellow, who also part times as an artist, as you can see. Um, what you can see is that, so this is a sort of peering into the human brain, a cross section of the human brain. Some of you may be familiar with this type of rendering of, of a human brain. And, and if you just peer inside, you can see these, these color coded uh, different structures, some of which are circular and, and ovoid and different different uh, different orientations and what this is is actually the, the limbic system of the brain which is also known as the, so, the social brain. it's really this part of the brain that regulates how humans and other species including mice take in information from the environment for appropriate behavioral output and in humans we're quite social so what we do is we recognize other people we recognize their faces we communicate with them and have appropriate cues in response to the conversations or social cues that, that are coming into our brains. Now, it's, it's this system in autism, at least the social part, that appears to be disrupted or disturbed in some specific way, and specifically that has to do with development.